And I've always heard a statistic you told me a little while ago, uh, Oksana. You said that when it comes down to brand engagement and to people to have you as top of mind, um, when you send bulky mail, something, whether it's large or whether it's small, there's a 100% open rate. So if there's a 100% open rate for something you send somebody, I mean, you might have a marketing campaign, you might spend $10, $20 per day to send out to lots of Facebook people. But if you bought and spent that money on sending something that's little, and, and I'm just going to show people uh, my pen here. Now, I had a grotty pen initially. And as you can see, there's no logo on my pen. Joey, show me a pen, mate. Pen. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I'm sure Darren's got one too. Now, what we will see there is no logo. However, we bought a, an expensive pen, stainless steel. It has a little bit of, it's got texture on it. So it had something that Oksana said, make it feel good. It's something that it feels, do you like it, J Joey? I can, yeah, it feels good. Yeah, okay. <laughs> now everyone call it that. When people come to us, they call it, I want a Steve's pen. <laughs> <laughs> so when we... No other. <laughs> so what we did was, uh, she said, well, look, uh, um, it doesn't have to be a big thing, but it has to be something that people will use. Now, uh, when it comes to the touch, make sure it feels nice. So we got one with a texture on it. And if we're sending marketing out and trying to get people to remember you, um, what I'm hearing here is that um, make sure it smells nice. I mean, uh, you did a wonderful campaign with, uh, with, with fruit and sent people fruit. So they smelt those sorts of things, but have a, a scent and then have a, a sound or some description. Well, that could be a, a, a video or, or some description, but I thought that the touch component of what you were talking about in marketing now, because everyone's gone away from just sending out flyers, but you've talked about when that sensory supposed, uh, you can see it, you can touch it, even, you can even smell it, uh, and uh, it'll create a feeling of, of uh, quality. So I just thought I'd just bring that up because it, it really uh, dovetailed nicely because in the day of digitization, that is completely lost. Yeah. And this is why people, you know, this is the biggest challenge this year because in Zoom, we we only the only senses we use it's uh, it's couple of senses. You can see people, um, and and you can talk to them. But another three senses, right? And people who live alone, this is the biggest challenge now because you know it's no touch, it's no interaction, it's no you can't smell people, you can't touch them, so. This is create a very challenging situations. And now even with the businesses, this is why we're so busy, you know, and you still doing it for your training. You sending them something in the mail. It's got 100% opening rate, number one. And secondly, it's create engagement, right? It's create engagement. And you adding, you know, you're asking what's your favorite snake snack and putting it in there create personalization so another level of engagement we have to make marketing about them a lot of time we market and we make it about us when you do the brochure and you all remember when you go to dealership that sell expensive cars when you take this brochure and they sell in ferrari or maserati you know this this brochure is has quality and they spend a lot of money on printing it. Why couldn't they do it, you know, cheap flyer from Vistaprint? Because this will communicate different message. So when you look at your brand and you have to ask yourself, if my brand is quality and prestige and I want people to feel secure when they're using my service, make sure your marketing material communicate that. 